Oh, oh, thank you. So, sorry, I guess I kind of zoned out. Oh, did you make my favorite? Oh, thank you. I'm kind of surprised you remember. I mean, you ha haven't made it for me like, like since we dated. No, they, it means a lot that you actually remember it after all this time. So, thank you. Mm. Oh. Seems you never lost your cooking touch. Yeah, I swear. You could cook for freaking gods. Um, our, our favorite show is on. You want to just want to want to watch that? Okay, cool. Well, actually, it's my turn to do the dishes tonight. So if you, and so if you want to just like rinse everything off and put it in this and put it in the sink, I'll do them later. Oh, oh, oh shit! Are you are you okay? Yeah, I saw. Yeah, I saw you like. Yeah, like the, uh, wait, did you drop? Uh, did you drop? Uh, drop the knife and accidentally cut yourself? Well, let me see. Let me see. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's just let me see it. Oh, that uh, there, that's deep. No, that, that's gonna take more than the than a band aid. He should, we may need to go to the doctor for that. You're just, just as stubborn as ever. Listen, just, okay, if if we're not going to go to the doctor, then I'll tr try and take care of it here. Um, it doesn't look like it's big enough or deep enough that it merits stitches, so that's a good thing, a good thing at least. But, uh... We do have, I believe, some peroxide and some bandages in the first aid kit. But yes, we have a first aid kit. <laughs> you, how long have you? How long has it been since you moved in? Exactly, and it took you this long to know that we had one. It's been here since longer and longer than you have. You are such a goof. Yeah. Now, now you're gonna tell me you didn't know we had a fire extinguisher. No, don't tell me. Okay, I'm kidding. We don't have one. <laughs> come on, I, you, come on. I had to. I had to do that. You know that. I just, you just sit here. Sit here. I'll go get that first aid kit. Okay. Ah, here it is. All right. Oh yeah, this is more than just the basics. We got like peroxide. We got gauze in here. And here, like we have every single type of bandage and bandage and band aid that you could ever ask for. And worst comes to worst, we do actually have like super glue in here in case that we do have that deep of a cut. Uh, we have like, yeah, we have like burn ointment and stuff like that. We have a lot of stuff in here. Yeah, it's worth knowing that we have it. <laughs> no, I don't think I'm gonna let that go. <laughs> Give me your hand. All right, so I'm gonna have to pour some peroxide on it. So, uh, do you want? Uh, Give me your other hand. You might want something to squeeze. This might sting a bit. Just hold your hand still. One, two, three. Oh, I know, I know it hurts. I know it hurts. Yeah, but trust me, this is a good thing. All right. 
and bandages. And there we go. Yeah. And you'll be good as new in no time. Well, what's with that grin? Well, of course I always take care of you. Why wouldn't I? Oh, yeah, I mean... I know we broke up, but that doesn't mean I don't care about you. Yeah, I've, I've cared about you since day one, just long before we broke up, and even and it kept, and even still after we broke up. I mean, think of it this way. Like, yeah, after after we broke up, we had to move to different places. But then after things didn't work out with your you know, your place and you came over here, did I hesitate to let you in? No, I didn't. Is it, did we, yeah, you came to the door, said, said you needed a place to stay, and I immediately grabbed your suitcases and said, Wait, I have a guest room, come on in. Like, yes, you remember that. And ever since that day, I've catered to your every single need. I wouldn't have done that if I didn't, yeah, you know, if I didn't love, uh, if I didn't care about you as much as I do. No, I, I wasn't going to say anything. Okay, okay. Yes, I admit it, I, I do still love you. That never went away after we broke up. But like, it, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's just, you and I are roommates, and that's just how it is. No, it doesn't. It, it really does. I mean, you broke up with me, so. No, 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 I'm not blaming you for anything. Not, not at all. Yeah, like, you, yeah, you broke up with me, so, uh, and so I had to have done something wrong. What do you mean I didn't? Then why did you dump me? If I didn't do anything wrong. I see. So, if I'm understanding what you're saying correctly, the reason you you, you bro uh, broke us off is not because of any problems with our relationship but because you just weren't ready no 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 that that's a good reason like i and yeah, like i can completely understand like you want you want to be ready for something that's serious before you go in but i'm just confused why you kept that from me like, if you would have just told me right off the bat, I would have understood. Yes, I would. Like I said, I... I love you. I always have. And if you just told me that you weren't ready for a serious relationship yet, I would have understood. I mean, yeah, it would have been... It would have been hard ending things off because I really enjoyed being with you. But... I would have done it for you. Please don't start crying, please. I'm serious. If you start crying, I will. Just look at me. Look at me. No matter what becomes of us, if we eventually get back together or we stay roommates or whatever it is, just know, I have always and will always love you with all my heart, and I will conti continue to take care of you for as long as I am still standing. Okay? I 
It's, sorry, it's just looking into your eyes this close. It's bringing back all of those memories. All those amazing times we had. We can, we can have those times again, you know? Uh, of course, if you're still not ready, then that's okay. You are? Really? <sighs> I love you. I love you so much. Yes, yes, I want this. I was sure that you were the one for me for a long, long time. And even if you, even if it took you longer to, uh, to for that feeling to be mutual, it's better late than never, right? I love you with all my heart.